Do you ever say the movie The Blind Side? I always say my life is the blind side on steroids. It's been life changing. Uh, I never planned this. I never started out with some grand plan to you know help lots of people. It was to help a kid in need have a room. I was living with my coach, and uh, when I was living with him, and it came the time that uh, there was no space at his house, so I had to go another place. And uh, she told my coach that uh, she got enough place that I can stay. I mean, right now she's like my mother. You know, she's watching me. She, you know, like she know what I'm doing. Yeah. It, it's, it's filled my life um, with passion and purpose, so with meaning that I didn't know was missing probably. I get so much more in return. That's just amazing. Now there's a lot of frustration too, but the joy, the laughter, the love, um, it's great. It's wonderful. I met Sandy through Jean Paul. Um, I consider Jean Paul as my, my second cousin, so um, we came from the same refugee camps and everything like that. She's definitely one of the special people that I met in my life that have influenced me to do uh, better things. So in terms of like college, I really didn't know what to do with college. I didn't know what college I wanted to go to, but she helped me. I think, you know, some of the guys are going to go to college, some are going to have a trade. John Paul, we hope, gets skilled as a barber. He would like soccer to continue on for him. So, you know, we'll see how that goes. But um, I see great potential in all of them. I think that's why I want to help out as a professor, and my husband's a professor too. We saw that these guys had such potential, but they needed opportunity. There's so many agencies, there's so many programs out there, but the, at the end of the day, if we could all just reach out and mentor one person and give that person opportunity, um, they could reach their full potential. And that's what I saw. These guys have so much potential, but they didn't have the opportunity my kids have. My kids have every opportunity in the world. And these guys don't for a variety of reasons. I love them. They're my sons, you know, unconditionally. So, some maybe more than others. <laughs> At different times, but very much so. Um, yeah, I love these guys. They're my sons. My African boys, I call them. My African sons. So. I definitely consider her uh, someone really close to my heart. Um, I think that she's really um, a beautiful woman with uh, beautiful intentions. And um, God should bless her for that. Yeah. <laughs>